Let's talk about why VOCs, which stands for volatile organic compounds, do not belong in your sauna. And a lot of companies on the market today, they have a ton of volatile organic compounds in the sauna, which are off-gassing and making people sick, meaning irritation to the throat, the lungs, the mucous membrane, headaches, dizziness, and it doesn't just go for saunas, it goes for furniture, mattresses, new floor. And so if you're not familiar with the term off-gassing or um, outgassing, it's basically when there's a very toxic chemical or product that has these VOCs that, or these petrochemical materials that off-gas and you smell it, you breathe it, you absorb it. The skin's the largest organ anything we absorb is absorbed within 26 seconds and it makes us sick. And especially with a sauna where you're going to actually sit and heal and your ultimate goal is to detox, you don't wanna be sitting in a sauna where this company uses toxic glue or multiple different types of glue to hold things together. Here at Clearlight or thesaunalife.com, we use a very, very small amount of a waterproof, non-toxic glue. Everything else is held together by little small um, pinhead nails. We don't use that toxic glue. We don't use petrochemical materials over top of the heaters that off-gas. We're not using um, wood that's not sourced properly or is full of formaldehyde. All of our wood is eco-certified, hand sanded, kiln dried, all comes from a sustainable forest. So it's very important that when you are going down this daunting rabbit hole to find the best company, that you ask that company if they can provide you a VOC report. Most of the time, they're not gonna be able to. Um, if you ask them about off-gassing or out-gassing, if you ask them about you know, where their wood is sourced, do they use glue in the sauna? Most of the time they don't even know, especially if they're just particular sales reps that just work for the particular company and they haven't really fully done their research. Here at um, thesaunalife.com with Clearlight Saunas, we can actually provide that test as well as all of our you know, credentials and anything that you need as far as the testing, we're gonna have that particular test for you. So it is important to ask, not just for a VOC report, but a EMF testing report, as well as many other certifications that we may have as a company. So VOCs, they don't belong in your house, even though it's very hard because in order to get everything super clean without any of these VOCs, it becomes very, very expensive. Flooring is a huge one. And so a lot of times people have to run, you know, IQ airs or air doctors to try to, you know, capture a lot of these VOCs that are, you know, floating through the air. And a lot of it you don't see because it's microscopic. But when you are going to do something for your health and you're going to be sitting in an infrared sauna, that's one place that you want to make sure that your sauna where you're healing is safe and quality. So VOCs do not belong in your sauna. I hope this video has explained a little bit more about why it's important to look at VOCs when you're investing in a sauna and to ask for a third party VOC report. Please make sure that you've liked this video, you've subscribed to Julie Bishop, and you comment below.